Maniacs, welcome back to the channel, doing another trailer reaction, and this trailer is for HBO Max's new series called Velma, and I'm sure it's focused on Velma from Scooby-Doo, it's another animated uh, property, and I think what they're doing here is they're going to be aiming toward, more towards an adult audience, so I'm not really sure where they're going to take this, I'm not really sure how this is going to be presented to us, but I, I just know... As a kid, I grew up watching Scooby-Doo. I've seen all the movies as a kid. Uh, Zombie Island is personally my personal favorite one. It has a lot of elements of just being scary and fantastic. I, I really like the, the risks it took by being a children's movie, but still like really kind of giving you the scares that you wanted. I mean, I'm, a, I'm just a big fan. I even, I even enjoyed the live action movies that came out in the early 2000s. I didn't like the last movie though. The last movie, Scoob, was dog shit. I hated it. I really did. It sucked. I, I didn't like it at all. We're going to go ahead and dive into this thing. I'll give you guys my personal opinions after the video, so hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, share the, channel, share the content, and uh, let's go ahead and dive into Velma. Dear HBO Max. Okay. I just Jeez. learned you intend to make a genre-bending comedic origin story of Judy Judson. Right. When I heard this new version of Judy Judson wouldn't be boy crazy, the only word I had to describe my disgust is jinkies. If there is one thing the internet agrees on, it's that you should never change anything ever. I hope you die. Sincerely, Velma. Well, at least Judy's still white. <sighs> okay. Okay. Hello, Velma Dinkley speaking. Hello, Velma. Do you like solving Oh, you know she does. Uh, yeah, but I'm actually much more three-dimensional than that. Who is this? That's the mystery. That's more three-dimensional. Solve it quick because I'm in your house. Love the, the scream killer reference. Calling from inside my house? Yes, that's a classic, and that's my point. Why change anything when the classics all still work, right? Wait, you're inside my house. <laughs> oh, did she die? Did she die? I okay. Um, I love the reference to Scream. That was fantastic. This is obviously going to get a lot of hate. Uh, it's obvious. Uh, it's oh, I'm aware. It's going to get a lot of hate. I, they're changing a lot here, and I, I don't know. To me, it looks like a fine time. I, I think it looks fun. It's very self-aware of what it's trying to do, which I at least respect that. The fact that she was like typing HBO Max and talking about how they're making a series about Judy Jetson and she's not all boy crazy and I'm gonna hate that because it's, you know, they're changing the original and then obviously they changed Velma. And again, like, I hope nobody like looks at me and says, you know, oh, this guy's a racist or whatnot and everything like that. Look, I'm looking forward to The Little Mermaid, okay? I I have nothing against this. So I'm, I, I just know that there's gonna be a lot of purists fans of Scooby-Doo who are going to watch this and be like, you know, because I, I've always looked at Scooby-Doo not being about politics or anything like that or being woke or anything along those lines. And it, it's it's kind of we're coming into this age now to where I almost expect it anymore when it comes to the properties I grew up with completely being changed over. I, I don't know much about the show what all is happening with it. So if you guys have any information, please leave them in the comments down below. Other than that, I thought the trailer was fine. I, I thought, you know, it was, it was kind of funny. I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know how the majority of the audiences are going to react to this. This is, again, very, you're changing up so much of something that has been around for so long. Uh, hopefully the show's good. I'm, I'm hoping. I, I hope it's at least decent. So I, I do apologize. This wasn't the reaction you probably were expecting. But again, it was just kind of one of those things. It's like, oh, okay, they're really changing it up, aren't they? Okay. So comment down below again, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel for the channel, share the content. If you have any more information about the show, please leave it in the comments down below. And uh, I am curious to hear what you guys think. So uh, yeah, until next time, guys, keep it retro and do take care. Holy shit, Michael. We made it to We Slaughter Barbecue. The epitome and the purpose of our trip is to make it to this area. Oh yeah, food and cattle. Yep. I just noticed, is that a cemetery way over there, or are those cattle? No, I think that is a small cemetery. Holy shit, that's kind of cool, and creepy. That thing is massive, but there's not just that one, there are spiders literally there's everywhere. There's one there, there's one there, there's one over there, and then, and then there's this one here. Dude, they're everywhere on the property, it's cool. Oh, there's one there! 